Teenagers that collided on Yellow Trail on the Alpine side of Palisades Tahoe around two yesterday afternoon. One of them, Scotty Lapp, a member of the Palisades Tahoe Big Mountain Competition team, died in that accident. The other team was on the Olympic Valley freestyle team and is recovering at the hospital, according to Palisades Tahoe. Lapp was a sophomore at Tahoe High School, and the school district says they brought in nine mental health professionals to resume the Placer County chaplain and therapy dogs to try to support those students. Money, 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 money ain't the motive. What's your name again? Nobody knows it. Don't speak to me. Do not talk, and I'm focused. Two, three, four. Four. They say I'm nutty, I'm picking the basket, I'm short of a sandwich, of peanut butter, boy, swapping to f***ing, he's coming get me, said I suck him at your neck, like a hippie boy, I'm sick, like an HIV victim, ain't nobody f***ing with me, I got bad from New Zealand, why he called me a demon, and the terrorist, God damn it, I couldn't believe it, been a kid from the country, I never fall, never temper, but you f***ed up as a pants, a child idol, and I clearly don't give a f***, so you can run that shit back and f*** your loud pack and Yo, Snapchat, cherry bomb, the greatest fucking album since the days of sound. Chick gon' pop just like that nigga that was never round. Damn, got the drop, gas up, thick exhaust. Young T, can't quit, off the beat, nigga soft. He ain't lying, he the truth. Call him Simba, beast to lose. Tyler, the creator, sweating Jesus juice. Put that fucking cow on my level, cause I'm raising the stakes. Mama made you promise, it's no more section 8. And what we ate was the stakes. Now our section is great, cause that's the level I'm at. Niggas pass him a plate, yeah! Why, 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 why don't they like me? Cause Nike gave a lot of niggas checks But I'm the only nigga to ever check Nike Richer than white people with black kids Scary than black people with ideas Nobody can tell me where I'm heading But I feel like Michael Jordan, Scottie Pippen at my wedding they say I'm crazy, but that's the best thing going for me. You can't lynch Marshawn and Tom Brady throwing to me. I made a million mistakes, but I'm successful in spite of them. I believe you like a fat trainer taking the bite or something. I want to turn the tanks to playgrounds. I dreamt the two pops. He asked me, are you still down? Yeah, my it's on, it's on, it's on, it's on. I know they tore their white daughters. Don't bring home Jerome. I am the freak, the archetype. I am the light and the beacon. You can ask the deacon. It's funny when you get extra money Every joke you tell just be extra funny I mean, you can even dress extra bummy Cocaine, bathroom, break nose, extra rummy And I gave you all I got, you still want extra from me Oxford want a full-blown lecture from me And the Lexus pull up, uh, like hop, the hop, hop, like what's up uh, 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 Step back, hold up, my, you suck, hold up Portions, the motions running out of Audubon speed level. I had a drink with fear, and I was texting God. He said, I gave you a big to so go extra hard. Scotty's favorite thing in the entire world was Lake Tahoe. He convinced his whole family to move to Tahoe. And the most magical thing was watching him capture what he saw in Lake Tahoe. All the moments that you think wouldn't be anything, that you think wouldn't look that cool, he could look at and make it this amazing photo. And watching him capture those photos was the best thing in the world because it was him. It was him and how he saw things and how he saw the world. And if you saw it how the way he did, you'd be amazed. Like I said earlier, Scotty got his whole family to move up to Tahoe. He was stubborn, and it was amazing that he could convince his mom that because he just loved Squaw with all of his heart, and it was just his home away from home, his everything, and it made him so happy to be here and to be living in Tahoe. And even now Ryan, they're both, they were both so happy living here that they 
were in their element. I think you find a kid who loves something so much, and then you capture them where they're supposed to be, and that's what how Scotty was when he was in Tahoe. Um, he just loved everything about watching the sunset, and he loved capturing it so he could show it to people, and he was so excited when he could show it to other people, like, look at what I saw through my eyes, and now I'm showing it to you the way I saw it. And he would go down to the beach every day, and he would stand in the meadow every day and watch the sunset and take photos of it just so he could show it to other people and make other people happy. All right, good job. <laughs> Mama, it's wrong. Right. I just want to be a part of the cool crowd. I just feel like I don't have what it takes. I have something here for you. This lip gloss, it worked for me. Scotty's gonna be going in here, right on this wall. Before Scotty died, he was starting to get into graffiti and street art. And so in honor of that, well, I drew some stuff, cast drew, painted some stuff, put some stickers up. And you know, Scotty also wanted to be global like the pandemic, so I got stuff in the Bay Area on the beach, stuff in Half Moon Bay, and stuff in Santa Cruz. And the the first painting that you saw was in Tau City. And this one here is in Santa Cruz. And this is a really cool one. And I mean, it's all Sharpies because Scotty loved to use Sharpies. And I don't know, I just love this drawing because it has like Scotty in it. And, you know, ski for Scotty, send for Scotty. Today we are out on Gold Coast, skiing for Scotty, getting those swervy smooth laps. 
Yeah, and he made it snow for us today. I'm from the middle finger, I'm from the east side. Man. Yeah. Don't see it. Yeah. Leaks, always sticks, all this shit. Hoes, set up, all this shit. Yeah, you know. In the club, we do all this shit. Come out your face. I'm from the five, middle finger, zone six. Dirty land, dirty stick. Bad bitches getting hit. Put a nigga on a lick. Rob a nigga for a brick. Rob a nigga for his shit. Young fall out, turn it to a snitch. Never turn it to a Shoot that. Gotta keep it 100 with you, never switch on your mask. Yeah, uh -huh. Go and get some money, gotta get some money, never hold your hand. Ow. Ezra. Yes, sir. How are you doing today? I'm doing good. Yeah. 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 We yeah. had a run in with Fadia. But <laughs> other than the that, casual <laughs> running with other, other than that, doing great. If you like, if you could describe Scotty in three words, what would you use to describe him? I would probably say like like energetic as one, like, just hype. We we'll use hype as one of them. Um, Steez. I feel like I can't even put words to what I like felt when I was around him because I swear that kid, he had like a he had some kind of aura. Like, every time I was near him, bro, I like, it just felt like when I saw him in the hallway or like if we were hanging out outside of school, I just felt like, damn, like, this, it just made me feel better. Like, I don't know why, but. You know, if, if Scotty was standing right here, what would you, what would you say to him? Um, I mean, the first thing I would do is we had this handshake. But no one, bro, no one was like coordinated. Like when I did it with him, bro, every time it just clicked. It was like, I just felt like, damn, bro, really cool. I wish I could, I wish I could ski with him. What do you have to say about the memorial skate park that is planned for Scotty? I think it's perfect. I think that is. That is something we'd always talked about. It was just like, oh my god, how do we not have a skate park? How is the closest skate park? Freaking Incline and Truckee. Yeah. Like, you such a mountain. Like, this whole community is, like, super mountain, like, indie type. A ton of people skate, and somehow we don't have a skate park. That's something we already talked about. And it sucks that this is how we get one, but I really think um, it honors him well. And this is something that will stand. Like, this will be around for so, so long. And it's a good way to just, like, never forget. Great way to honor him. Yeah. Yeah. What was Scotty's favorite line on the mountain? Whoa. Well, that's difficult. Because... Like, I mean, if it would be easier, you can give me a top three. Well, like, okay, well, it was just kind of his mood, you know? Some days, he'd bring out the parachute pants, the colorful jacket, <laughs> and he'd be like... We're running Belmont Gold Coast all day. We're gonna do some dog. He'd instantly he'd bring his poles with him and then instantly drop them for the whole day. Just hide them in a tree and be like, "What? Why did you even bring those out here?" <laughs> he'd swerve. He'd do his little like kick threes. It's just like that's what he'd do. But then there'd be other days where he'd show up and be like, "Oh, Jib Lab's insane today, man." And then that's all we ski. You'd have the whole mountain, and we'd ski just KT all day, and it was it was insane. <laughs> but it, it was definitely those three where I think were his favorite. I'm doing an interview, but <laughs> go what? home, kid. Go home. You came here. It's my house. What? That's my phone. Damn. All right, Jack. What? What do you think Scotty's favorite line on the map was? Probably Belmont. You know. Most of the time, he was in Belmont. Yeah, definitely Belmont. <laughs> and what were Scotty's favorite skis? You know, we all shit on him for this, but like the lines, he stuck to the Sir Francis Bacon's every day. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I saw him out there on those lines.
They kind of look ridiculous, but... Broke five pairs of those. Still skied them. If you had the chance, if Scotty were sitting right here, and the camera ends, um, what would you, what would you say to him? Speak, speak to the camera like it's him. What's up, Scotty? Um, you know, miss you out in Belmont right now. Miss those cork fives and those RRRs we'd hear behind you. Yeah, we miss your attitude, man. As I'm getting old, the chip up on my shoulder, rolling through life, you roll over and die. La 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 la, la 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 la, la 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 la. Miss a little John, sad days are gone. Remember things just in time. smiling inside about how much fun Scotty always had and how we lived every day and every moment to the fullest. We're excited that everybody came here uh, to celebrate Scotty. Um, it's crazy, you don't sometimes know how far your kid reaches and it's clear by this room that he had some amazing reach. <laughs> Scotty means a lot of things. It means coming together in kindness and love. And I think that's what he's taught all of us in this life. And we need to do that for others. Be for Scotty. Be for Scotty. Be for Scotty. It's been a little minute since I've seen you, and I just gotta say, I love you, Scotty, and you know, you really, you really changed my life, and I'm really thankful for that, and I know that you changed a lot of people's lives, and I know that you wanted to go down as a legend, and I mean, you did that, so I guess congrats on that, but if you... Like, if you could describe Scotty in three words, what three words would you use? Like, energetic as one. Really hype. That's three. <laughs> Dude, there's so many. Contagious. <laughs> Not in a sick way. <laughs> Crazy. It's just good vibes. Good vibes. Mm. Yeah. It's hype. Clumsy. Stellar and stupid. Like, just hype. We'll use hype as one of them. Insane. And then fantabulous. Fantastic and fabulous mush. As Franny used, fantabulous. And curly hair, but count that as one word. Um, Steez. Just great person. Steez E. S T E E Z Y. Steezy Mofo. It's not one word, but mush one of a kind together, and that's Scotty Lap. Love you. Peace. If it was my last day on earth, if it was my last day, if it was my last day on earth, if it was my last day. If I close my eyes and the sun don't rise, would I be okay? If it was my last day on earth, if it was my last day, if it was my last day on earth, I wouldn't be in church. I'm sorry, God, but it's my last day in this universe. I need to see birds and buzzing bees, green grass, evergreen trees. I'm seeing people who have been mean to me.